Hey everybody, it's Chris from 2911 Homestead here from the Ag Expo in Moultrie, Georgia. I'm gonna take you around to a few of the uh, tractor exhibits and show you some of the vendors that are here. So come along with me. So we got Mahindra over here. Got Coyote tractors over here. I'm gonna go look at the uh, TYM here in a minute. I'm gonna walk down here and show everybody some of these tractors. So here we've got the uh, 2515 TYM tractor. It's a pretty uh, popular tractor right now. 24 horsepower. There's some stats on it. This one's outfitted with the, uh, the BL150 loader and then also the BH 150 back hub. Very nice looking tractor. So this is a 2515H. Um, I believe this also comes in shuttle. It's a very, very nice tractor. This is probably the tractor that we're gonna go with on the homestead. Um, unsure yet. This is probably the one that we're gonna go with. Got the controls up front. Right there. Like I said, this is a hydrostatic drive. With the back up. So hopefully y'all like some old tractors because next few years it'll be a lot of old tractors on our channel in the winter. But y'all recognize this tractor, it's a Ford 3000 1972 model, just like the one we have on the homestead. Fully restored, fully painted, very very nice tractor right here. So hopefully next few years I'll be restoring ours back to this. And over here we got the big component booth. Big large component booth. So we'll kind of walk around the edge of it, but I'm comforting your presence here at the expo. And there's Beef Co. So Attachments. Not real familiar with that brand. Looks like they've got some flail mowers, some tillers, some rotary cutters, some big finish cutters maybe. I think I see a log splitter over there. But yeah, I see a lot of a lot of orange over here. They've got pretty much everything in their line. They got the down to the lawn tractors and the BXs and some zero turns. Got some of their sidekicks. Their uh, excavators and 
Even got a wheeled uh, loader over there. Some wheeled skid steer loaders. Some track loaders. And some of their implements, their brush cutter, grapple over there. So, pretty good presence over here. Got a L2502 with their Land Pride. Um, rotary cutter and then a U10-5. So I got the Bobcat, some Yanmars. Got some Iron Bull gooseneck trailers and a big dump trailer. Not a big fan of the big dump trailers. You seem to be able to overload them a little too much. Mm. Then we have the Solus tractors. Got a, right now they've got a 24 horse tractor with a cab with air conditioning on the market. They're coming to market with this uh, Solus electric tractor. I'll put some links to some videos if I can find any in the description below here. And then they've got a, this is a 40, no this is a 55. This is a 60 horse that's coming to market. And then I believe that this one is a little bit on the other side here. Seventy-five horse. Good look at that. Very nice tractor. And then this is a sixty-five, fifty-five. Right? Yes, fifty-five horse with a cab. Take a look in here at this cab. Very nice. Air conditioning up there, radio. There we go. Real remotes come standard on them. Nice big hefty three point hitch. One thing that I'd like to see more manufacturers do is get the three-point lever out here so that it's easier to hook things up when you're dealing with uh, with a cam tractor. And then this here is a 35 horse, I believe, or 48 horse, but it is a uh, Yanmar engine, so it's a little, I'm not sure on all the prices on it. I think I misspoke, and I think that this is a 35, this might be a 40 horse. Not a 75, not sure. Let me go get this tractor here that's got a
cabin. And then it's got a rooftop air conditioner that's all electric, so it doesn't take away any power from the tractor. So over here we got some wood mise, uh, wood, the wood miser booth. Take a look at that. And I don't know if I mentioned it, but there is a lot of vendors here. I didn't get around to just about everybody and filming everybody, but there's a lot here. So if you are in the southeast, this happens every year in October. I'll put the dates down in the description of the video. But this this show is pretty cool. So you see, you've got the, the LG 15s. That's all. This is the wide one. This is the uh, Woodmiser Edger. Buddy, that'll do it from the show. We'll probably have a few videos out about the things that we saw, things that we learned from here at the Sunbelt Egg Expo in Maltry, Georgia. Saw a lot of things. Um, but this video, as you saw, was a lot about the tractors, a lot about the equipment that was here. So we checked that out. But anyways, I will see y'all on the next one and thanks for watching.